welcome to a new series that Blank Core Productions will be doing called Fallen Angels. Da, 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 starring, da, da, da. guest starring Slimac55 for this episode. Um, basically, what we're going to be doing in this series is basically attempting to build, hopefully, a pretty cool looking village. Yeah! Maybe with a different type of age, um, ages around it, so like, one medieval one, one, um, I don't know. How about we do something modern? That would be really cool. A oh. modern one as well, but like, I'll all sorts like, of stuff. Like, I can do modern. I know what modern looks like. like. Modern looks like I'm the boss. But yeah, like, I'm playing and being like, you know, like, old-fashioned turrets and walls around the outside, maybe a dock, that kind of thing. We've got a nice, lovely, deep water bit here. So yeah, I'm hoping, that's, hopefully this will be pretty good. Yes, uh, especially considering I've got the best uh, building tool imaginable in this game. I've got some watermelon right here, and uh, you will see the ama amazing power of the watermelon in the near future. Indeed, it's quite impressive. You, you guys will be amazed. You're in for a real treat. Yes. But, um, yes, this will not be a survival building one. This will be all in creative. Madness! So, um... We will be using the too many item type things like the, this. The creative mode on Minecraft. Pretty much, yeah. They added the we only back when Minecraft was only survival. We only used two mods. There was the fly mod and too many items, and now both of those have turned into the creative mode. So it's really convenient, actually. Yeah. Just so I put that out there. Not that you care, but oh. Pretty much. So yeah, we um. I reckon we should start from around this beach. This will be like the main beginning of this town, city. We should make really nice houses around here. After all, they'll probably cost a lot because they're right on the ocean. Exactly. Some Something like on uh, Bondi or in America, like the Miami type yeah. houses. All right, we've just been walking around, so I'm going to actually start building something. Sam, I'm going to build like a mad <coughs> castle. I mean, turret. Fantastic. I'm going to build a... Stone bricks. I'm going to build a block of iron. I'm done. <laughs> See, I have accomplished a lot. I built, I built an entire building right here. You, you're, you astound me, man. You're amazing. I'm a genius. Well, it would look cool. Um, really. Not iron. Now, How about a stone? Let's, uh, let's start off with the fact that we, we have not, we are not intelligent people. Indeed. Which, which was pretty obvious, and but in this specific case, we're especially not intelligent because we did not install world edits, so everything will be built by hand at this point. You know, except. Will be on creative, so it's obviously not as difficult, but you get the idea. So, um, yeah. Pretty much. I guess, I don't know if it will have, what the commentary will be like, because this is, well, this is this. And, uh, we've already made it pretty clear we're not working on the same building, so there's not really much we can say, you know, that's, uh, that's relevant to what each other is doing, but. Uh, I guess there's some fancy editing technique we could do to to make this more entertaining. I mean, we'll see what what kind of magic happens in the post-production house. Yes, we have a post-production house. We are we are a high-budget Minecraft show now. Yes. Just thought I'd put that out there. But what? But the other thing that we'll be doing is showing both people's point of view, so you won't be just stuck watching, like, for example, my point of view when Matt's building something amazing. Well, and I'm just building simple. Well, hardly. The only amazing thing I would build is I don't know. I'm not good enough to think of a joke in that time span. <gasps> Disregard. Okay, but yes, we shall do our very best to entertain. Yes. So, um, speaking of entertaining, I think I will try and uh, and make a commentary very funny. So I will start off with a joke. So, um. Uh, here's, here's one I, I'm pretty sure no one's heard before. Why did why did the chicken cross the road? Never heard of that. Why? Why would he? Well, you see, the chicken was obviously programmed by an evil genius, and <laughs> as a result, he kind of had no free will. So it's a little bit of a misnomer to say why did the chicken cross the road because the the chicken wasn't really the one crossing the road. It was actually um, the evil scientist making him cross the road would be so. The correct answer to that would be why did the evil scientist, you know, make the chicken cross the road? And the answer to that is just to get to the other side. 
I see. It's a pretty um, it's a it's a pretty intelligent and witty joke. I mean, you you never would have. It's 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 one of those jokes that you really can't predict from the outset, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Well, I really got of course it was very um diabolical kind of like very intense. Yes. It 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 was that. It's one of the few jokes that, while also being incredibly, incredibly funny, also builds up an immense amount of suspense and horror while you're while you're listening to it. I mean, it's it's truly an experience, and um, and obviously I can't tell it right every time, so I apologize if I if I you know failed on some of the delivery that time, but um, but I try my best, and uh, really that's all you can hope for. Exactly. Meanwhile, uh, what kind of uh, what kind of amazing joke or and or comedic genius can could we hear from you? Well, you see, I'm not a great comedian. Um, my jokes are more for like the dry humor type of people. Yes, the the more deadpan sarcasm. I'm not I'm not really into that, but uh, I can I can see why some people would be. Like, I enjoy the other type of jokes, I just can't tell them to save myself, so... Yeah, I know what you mean. Mm. I'm not... I, I just... Whenever, I'm tr- whenever I try to be deadpan, I just kind of start laughing. I'm just not good at it. You know, it's just... Yeah. It's just not my thing. It, it happens to the best of us. I guess so. I mean, I, I tell myself that, because sometimes that, that's what you need to tell yourself to, to wake up in the morning. I oh, know. It's... It's okay. Yes. So, um, so yes, what, what can, can you give us some examples of the, the more serious deadpan and stuff? Well, my, this isn't much of a, this isn't actually a joke. This is more of, um, my favorite pickup line. Uh-huh. Yeah. That, those are always good. Yes. Um, mine is, so, so you walk up to a chick right there, you really want to go out with and stuff, and you basically okay. go up and say, hey babe, how do you like your eggs in the morning? Uh-huh. Scrambled or fertilized? Oh, well, that is that is certainly. If I was if I was a girl, I would I'd just be wet right now. But, I know. Um, it, it it tends to ha- it's a common side effect of telling these tremendous jokes. They they really it, that that really is a a very very well done um on pickup line, and uh, yeah, I've got something kind of like that. Um, okay, hang on, I'm just gonna have to I'm just gonna have to remember it because it, it's. It's pretty long. Um, I think it goes something. I might. I might be wording this a little, um, a little strangely, just because you know, memory. My memory is just not the best, you know. Um, but I. I reckon. Um, it, I'm pretty sure it goes something like this. Okay. Will you have sex with me? <laughs> that, that's that's. Yes, I. I know it's. Um, it's not perfect, but I, I think. I think it's pretty good. I think it. I think it. I haven't actually tried it, but, you know, um, I, I can't see why it wouldn't work. I, I couldn't see a reason why not either. That's, yes, that's I mean, incredible. It's, it's, it's really the clearest thing. I mean, it's, it's, some of these pickup lines are pretty hard to, to understand. Like, I had to have that, you know, that Tennessee one? I had to have that one explained ah, to me. Ah, yes, just, yes. That was just way too complex for me. I mean, you can, I mean, there are so many, like, "Quote unquote smart ones," but I mean, just don't don't make your pickup lines too smart. I mean, it makes it hard to understand. I mean, it's yeah, and simple, that's not, simple people won't. That's not going to that's not going to get you anywhere in in life. Just being too smart. No. How how is that going to? I mean, yeah. What, since when would, would that be any sort of like beneficial? Really? Yeah, benefit to to anything in life. Just be. Intelligence is really a waste of time, I must say. No, especially when you could be here. Yeah, exactly. With us. And we're having a mad time at the moment. Like, yeah, I mean, you know, you, you see all those other, you know, teenagers on, on, on a Friday night who go to, like, parties and stuff. I mean, you know, that's, that's, all, that's all well and good, but, I mean, this is, this is really where it's at. You know? <laughs> Party? I've never been to one in my life. Well, yeah, me, me neither, and really, I mean... I, why would I, you? Why would you? I mean, that's that's... It's kind of, uh, it's such a such a silly thing. Indeed, I I I I'm honestly proud of the fact that I I don't I don't do any of that that, that rubbish. No, Sammy. Why would you? Like, what's the point? That's, that's 
meet new people. You've got great people here. Who needs yeah, to exactly. meet new you, people? You've got plenty of NPCs to keep you company. Why, why would you need people? I mean, that, that NPCs, they're, they're so much easier to understand. They're so much nicer. And if you don't like them, you can always just, you know, take them with a sword. Or, or set them on fire. I mean, if it does, just doesn't work out, I mean, just a little fire never hurt anyone. And it's not just Minecraft. It can be any game, really. Like, there's always, like, cod. You can shoot them if they don't get it. They yeah, don't like I you. Mean, I mean, that's, that's, a nice, that's a nice way of dealing with your problems as well. I mean, sometimes, sometimes it just doesn't work out for people. Yeah. And, uh, and that's okay. Yeah, that, that's okay. That, that's that's a, a normal part of human online interaction. Mm-hmm. And uh, and when that happens, you know, there, there's nothing, no problem with um, with just pulling out a gun and you know, double tapping to them to the head a couple times. But remember, always double tap. Yeah. Well, if Zombie well, Land has taught us anything, double tap is the way. Well, sometimes you can't be too careful. So exactly. Well, um, so yes, what are we? What are we actually building? I I must say this uh, this floor. I am building just a floor, and it's taking forever. This is what this is the kind of time when I wish I had world edit. Indeed, same. Um, maybe for our next episode, we'll have a deeper understanding of what we're trying to accomplish. Yes, it's also becoming nighttime, and I believe we didn't turn monsters off, so... It makes it more entertaining. You should probably come over to mine, mine's up, and help me build this, because this is incredible. Well, I could, or, well, oh, well, mine, mine obviously has had a lot more effort put into it, I must say. Well, clearly, but, you know, I mean... Win some, you lose some. Well, I guess. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll make my way over to to your place thingy, and uh, I'll chill there for the night, and I think maybe we'll call that uh, as our first episode. Mm. Uh, okay. We may as well. I suppose so. But, um... Is there actually an entrance to this thing, or...? Um, well, there's a window that you might okay, have to fly into. I just went into the window. A window. Alright, I'll just chill on the roof. I don't think creepers can fly. Oh, uh, no, they're pretty crafty. That's true. I mean, there's really no telling what a creeper can and can't do. It's just kind of one of those things. Oh, wow. A, a skeleton has already spawned. Actually, two of them have already spawned in my building. Oh, lovely. Yeah, well, I guess I guess we may as well call it here. Yes, okay. um, I might just put... Ah, oh, I hate it when that happens. It's the least box. But anyway, yes, um... So, um, ooh. Indeed, very accurate. I like yes, it. Yes, I, I, I pride myself on being informative to the general public. Uh, I think that's a, pr- a very good thing to have. It's something that people would look for in a job. That, yeah, I, I hope so. I mean, I've never been employed. I mean, I, I just don't see any, any reason in, in a job. But um, if, if I ever had to, I mean, my, my parents have a, have a pretty steady retirement fund, so I don't need to... I don't need to get a job, but if I if I ever did, then I'm sure it would be very easy given all the talents that I have. Indeed, like, well, really, why would you need to when you, that's per- when you can be perfectly happy living in your parents' basement, well, getting free food? Exactly. I mean, there's really there's really no reason to. I mean, all those people who say like you know move out, I mean, they're just jealous that that they don't have what well, we have. Yeah, what well, we have. So, so really, you know. They're the one. They're the needy ones. Exactly. I mean, they. Yeah. Selfish, even. Selfish. Yes. You know what? They. I didn't actually notice this before, but they actually disgust me. Well, I. I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, they. I'm kind of. I'm kind of gagging right now. Um. You know. I kind of. Just the thought of them kind of almost makes me vomit, and you know that's kind of how I'm feeling at the moment. It's just. It's just overwhelming uh, to a certain extent. I don't think I'll be able to go on. But and to be honest, I don't blame you. Yeah. Well, I think if said episode ending, I guess. Okay. Well, when's that gonna happen? Um, as soon as I finish this bit of the roof, and when we come yeah. back, it shall be. This turret will be done, and we might start on a wall, or I might help Matt 
if he's building or you know I could just be selfish and with that darkening thing I shall look out the window and say see you all later see ya and have a good one